Hilda and I'm a trainer at Mind Apples. And at Mind Apples, we try to help people get the most from their minds by understanding a little bit about how they work. And I often get asked, well, what can I do to help my mind? What can I do to manage my mind? And there's lots of little tips we can give. So I thought I'd do a little bite-sized tip today about mindfulness. So have you ever been in a situation where you can't focus on just one thing and your mind's very active and you're going from one thing to another? So for example, you might think, oh, I'll sit down and read a book. And then you think, oh no, I'll make a cup of tea. And then whilst the kettle's boiling, you think, oh, I'll just check Facebook. And whilst you're checking Facebook, you think, oh, I'll put the laundry on. And whilst you're putting the laundry on, you think, oh, I need to change the bedding, et cetera, et cetera. It goes on and on. And I'm really a lot like that. And it's something that I would really like to change. I'd like to be able to focus a bit easier on one task at a time. So I've been practicing mindfulness. And this does not come naturally to me, so I really do have to practice, but I can see it making a, a difference for me. So mindfulness is not at all complicated. It can be a really simple daily practice that you do. So um, you can get an app, but you don't have to. You could just do a simple mindfulness practice each day where you bring your mind to focus on the present. So what I do is I set an alarm on my phone and give myself a time limit and I try and focus on just one thing. And I do sensory mindfulness, so I focus on either something I can see, hear, taste or smell. And I'll sit and just think about that without judgment for uh, the amount of time I've allocated. So it's usually just a minute or so. And what usually happens is I sit down to focus. So I, at the moment I've been out in the garden quite a bit and we've got a lovely plant growing with some beautiful red flowers on it. So I'll sit and look at this plant. I think I'm just going to do this for a minute. And what happens is my mind starts to wander and I think, oh, I could actually ring my mum right now or I could be doing this, that or the other. But I let those thoughts come and go and try and stay focused on the flower that I'm looking at. And that in a nutshell is mindfulness. And what that does, it helps me train my mind to focus on one thing at a time. So the next time I'm busy and trying to do lots of different things at once, it's just a bit easier for me to slow down and think about just one thing to focus on. So I hope that's helpful. It's a little tip for you about how to manage your mind. Keep coming back for more tips. We're doing lots of videos and tip sheets showing people little things they can do that might help. And we look forward to seeing you soon.